You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. Well, the city has started the healing, and that's the big thing, is trying to find out how to heal. Uh, it was a process, and it's still a process, and it's a grieving process. June 30th marked the one-year anniversary of the Allen Massacre, which claimed the lives of three law enforcement officers and a canine, Drago. The impact of their sacrifice is still felt throughout the city of Prestonsburg. You know, these guys had very fulfilling lives, and they were doing what they loved, and they are doing what they thought was right at the time and it was no question about it that they stepped up when others wouldn't. The city is dedicated to honoring the lives of the fallen heroes. The bridge, formerly known as the Burt T. Combs Bridge, was renamed to the Heroes Bridge with the name of the fallen officers and canine on display. Well, you know, this event happened and then just two weeks later it started flooding. So there was an opportunity for a lot of healing at that time. So I think that stretched the healing process out for a while. But uh, eventually everyone come together and it did bring everyone together for a period of time and we're hoping that people will let that carry through. The memories of Floyd County Deputy William Petrie, Prestonsburg Patrolman Jacob Chaffins, Prestonsburg Police Captain Ralph Frazier, and Floyd County Sheriff K-9 Drago will forever live on in the memories of those in the communities they swore to protect. A candlelight vigil will be held in their honor on the evening of June 30th. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Dean.